Now yeah. you got the weird sun I on know, your I face. I the sun on my eyes. We're here at the Goodwill, y'all. All right. We are at what he lovingly calls the Hill Store. But I get comments saying, you never say where you are. We do. This is the um, Lady Lake. Lady Lake Goodwill. We say we say it all the time. Lady Lake this Goodwill. This is just what he calls it. In Lady Lake, Florida. Mm -hmm. So if you're in Michigan, this is where we are. <laughs> Lady Lake, Flo Florida. But um, we haven't been here in I think like a week. We haven't been to this one. So we're crossing our fingers that they're going to have some good stuff for us to show you guys, for us to pick through on the shelves. Um, we need some stuff that we can resell. Uh, we do our live sales Thursday nights, so we need some stuff for that. And then our eBay has been kicking ASS, so we need to keep up with that. And so. I'm almost at a thousand Instagram sales. <gasps> he is. I know it's small potatoes, but to me it's big. No, you know, and it'll 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 do just like my my YouTube. You go and you get you get to that that milestone, that next number, and then someone unsubscribes and it brings you back down. So, Mister Chapter Two. Vintage Co. on IG. On Instagram? Yep. So, yeah. All right, let's do it. Let's go shopping. It's nice and cool today. It is actually 50 degrees. Well, it was 50 when we woke up. Um, I have a little sweater on. Aaron doesn't have anything because he thinks he's up north folk. I am. <laughs> uh, but see, even that guy has a jacket on. But it's nice. It's going to be nice all it's week. Posh. Never understood that. Well... It's like it keeps you just warm enough and it keeps you kind of cool. Feet at the main sensors. <laughs> and your head. And your head. Look. They have bags. So the color this week is orange. So that is the magic color we need to find unless they're taking it all off the shelves. <laughs> like they normally do. For whatever reason. So these are, they've gathered some orange bags and stuck them in here. Seeing if there's anything good I can use. And then they have a... This guy's got the legs like me. He's got your legs? Short. He's got my hips. <laughs> Short arms and dinosaur arms. Too, look. My T-Rex arms. Where's this one? They made little Easter baskets. That's a cute idea. Cute. Okay. Let's follow this guy over here. I don't see anyone taking anything off the shelves. So that's a good sign. He's gonna go that way. I think. Oh, did you find something? That orange. What is that orange face? That's kind of pretty. It is. You just stepped right in my way. I'm trying to help you. It's... No, nothing good. It looked uh, pretty from afar. Glass apples. Okay. Well, I'll let him look over there. We're gonna go this way because we always look at the same darn thing when we come in here. Let's check out the mugs first. What do we got? That's pretty. Creamer. Um, I'll see if that stitch mug was still here. That's the last time we were here. Whatever the heck day that was. I'm not seeing it. So I'm curious if someone brought it to their attention and was like, what the heck is this? Or someone actually paid that price. It would be crazy if they paid for that. Mm-mm-mm. Oh, here's a happy face made in China. The older happy face mugs used to sell really well, but if you look them up, they don't really anymore. They sure don't. Check out the faces. It's kind of cool. This one's a cool shape too. That sorrel in there. This one, gosh, I see this one all the time at the uh, thrifts. It's almost like spotting these clear things. What is this? No. This kind of sort of like a swung vase. This would be half off. Gosh, that's just a pain in the neck to get that out of there. Yeah. I've tried so many different things. That's cool, a palm tree. I like that. 
See, look, here it is again, but in a different pattern. <laughs> I always see that one. Always. That's a nice candy dish down there. Got a brandy snifter here. This looks like crystal. Oh, it's like a, maybe a shade or something. Party naked, y'all. <laughs> Party naked. Hmm, that's a nice stein. Oh, that's pretty. All those. It's got a lot of little chips on it. A flying pig. This looks like I can come down now. Okay. Some stuff I might like. Okay, let's go see. First, let me look at this. I have to see this. It's sixty dollars. You guys, I didn't show them because we found them off camera. Should see the old Crocs that we found for like twelve ninety nine. All right, you guys. So here's one of the Crocs. I have. I want to get like a some kind of planter or some kind of plant for it. So I, I do check when I go to the thrift store. Um, gosh, I never even took pictures of this. I'm terrible. I'm trying to be better with social media, but um, this one, I want to say this one was $12.99. It has this beautiful bird on the front. It has the number five right there. Um, it's pretty heavy. It's got a nice old bottom. Uh, but so I had stuck this right here. It doesn't go with my table or my, that's Giselle, um, anything, but I want to get a plant. So I like, I suck it there. And then over here, we found this big crock right here. It has a gorgeous crown on the front with the number 10. And this one was like $14.99. And I have this fake plant in here. This was thrifted. I need to, you know, when you gotta clean your plant leaves off because they're dusty. Yeah, that's me now. Um, but all these are thrifted right here. Uh, so there's that one. And then let me show you one more. It's in my craft room. All right, in my craft room right now. And this is it. It's Marshall Pottery Ink does have some information 1955 or something on the bottom let me see if this one still has a price sticker on it i might have taken it off the one oh no there it is 8.99 i was gonna say the one time i don't i don't i take the price stickers off of stuff but um they were all so cheap so we got them all so this i was gonna try and do something in here maybe with a pretty plant or something um but i need to find some plants that aren't terribly gross Sometimes when you find them thrifting, it's got like the cigarette smoke and like the kitchen grease on them. Um, if they're dusty, we can like clean them off, right? But man, that kitchen grease is hard. So uh, I'm hoping that I can um, get some plants for these. So yeah, that was a great find. So that's that's a cool terracotta pot, but um, we got a really good deal. Oh, mama. Oh, you could do like butt squat lift things. I need it. <laughs> for your pancakes. Okay. Oh, look, here's a Squishmallow. It doesn't have its tag, but it is a Squishmallow. A mermaid one. Oh, that's a nice pillow. Very nice. Okay, let's see what he's talking about. Oh, that's pretty. It's missing a little thing, but... An antler. Uh, missing an antler? antler? It's broken here, too. <laughs> it's missing an antler. All right. Oh, look. I loved these state plates, you guys. I don't know if you remember, like, way back in the day, I had a cool sale with a bunch of state plates. Oh, this is neat. This planter. That goes to it, didn't it? No, that looks like a... Looks like a wall hanger, oh, like a plant a hanger. No. That's kind of cool. I don't know if you like that. Someone else probably will like Not it. For I know. <laughs> oh wait, wait, listen. Oh, it's got something in it. I didn't even see that. What's in there? Oh, a stocking. I've noticed uh, the prices are getting a little more pricey think? here. Yeah. Yeah, I know. You want to get this? I don't know how much it is. Oh, I don't know. Mm -hmm. <sighs> That's cool. Don't you like? It's almost shit? like out of spite. I don't want to. I don't want to pay it. Let's see. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, that's pretty. 
Is it Party Light? Who is the queen of Party Light? Deidre. Deirdre. <laughs> I think it's a two dogs. Four ninety nine. That's pretty. If it doesn't so have any so, okay, so let me chips see or anything. Show what, what's the color? Orange. Okay, so look at here. Okay. Mhm. Mm Price. Then you come on down here. Okay, hold on. Let me turn around. Don't get mad at me. It's the same guy. Uh huh. Different people pricing. Wow. Oh. But it's the exact same guy. Yeah. And you get two of them with this one. I think this is kind of neat. If I it doesn't two. have any chips. I did too, yeah. See, see and when see. we were in the sale with Dee and Miss Pamela, like they had all this beautiful stuff that we love, but like nobody was buying. So yeah. it kind of scares me to pick that up. Yeah, it does. For the live sale anyway. Maybe for like eBay I can do something with it, but... Um, oh, what are these? Some handmade stuff. Party light. Some handmade little jars and vases. See, I don't really do anything with those. Um, was there anything else that you needed me to spot? Oh, that thing down there. What is that thing? This? I don't know. Something Thanksgiving. Oh, wait. Is this a uh, paper towel holder that this hooks to and then a napkin holder? Oh. Huh. Yep. That's probably what that is. But I do kind of like this guy. Maybe I should just put him in the cart okay. and I'll think about it. You can do that. Yeah. Because he's cool. I've never seen a... Um... Dracula planter. This little bear is cute. All right, I guess I'll move on. I'll wait to see if they bring out any carts. What's this guy real quick? Him and all his luster. Missing something. Oh, he was probably a liquor bottle. These pumpkins are cute. Somebody made them. And then I saw these. These look like spreader, you know, those like spreading knives, cheese spreader type things. More pottery stuff. Seminoles Fund. Okay. Moving on. If you know me at all, I have to check the candle section. So look at that. That's cool. It's missing its little dangly dues, but that one actually looks a little wait. There we go. It's missing its dangly dues. But that's cool. This is like a starburst. It's orange. Who made you? Oh, Bath and Body Works. $19.99. So it's a candle stand. Bath and Body Works. Interesting. That might be an eBay thing. Oh man. One day I'm going to find one of those glassy baby things. I've already found Fire and Light. I just need to check that one off my list. Ooh, look how pretty those are. Let me look at these. Like ornaments. Pretty cool. Aaron found some stamps. I said, wait. I gotta get there. Yeah, some of them are. Remember, we did good with that one cat one. That was in the bag or the bucket or whatever. Like, here's another cat. But it's not that same artist, I don't believe. It's a PSX, I think. No? But it's $8. Ooh, post-its. We need post-its. Too bad that's not a half-off thing. Because post-its are cheaper than that. But that's usually how I get them. Is in these bad bags? Look at that. Bunnies with pots on their heads? 
Yep. Some ribbon. Brushes. Some more bunny things. I think. There's a bunny too. Mary Kay. Cell phone holders. What's in there? There's a turtle. Independence Hall. Markers. Oh, look. One tiny little pet shop. Okay. I guess nothing else really that I would use. Okay. I do need to find a tin because I want to create. Oh, that's cool. That adds to a calendar. I want to create like a like a little box lot of something, but I want a little tin to put it in instead of like a bag or a bucket or something, but that looks like the only tin at this store. And I don't really, I wanted it to be something cool, you know? But I'm not seeing any tin here. Even that I could use for the house. Those are neat. Some of these things, you guys, turn out to be like pottery barn and stuff, so... I always look at them. Those are cool. Got the plastic stuff over there. Alright. No, you know what? I just saw a news article. Goodwill is in the news because they are selling a empty salad container. Um, I think it was these are neat. $45 from like Kroger or something. They want $20 for it. But they are selling an empty salad container for more than the salad cost at Kroger or some store like that. This is cool. $4.99. So I'm like, good. They should because I see that all the time. That's nice too. Signed St. Peter Street, New Orleans. That's a nice sketch. And then, um, I was reading that and I thought it was hilarious. So this is something we could use for crafts. These tickets. Someone, oh, this is someone's art. Look, they made a collage. You talking to me? Ellen, 2020. <laughs> that's what she, that's what she named it. Let's see what you named this one, Ellen. They covered it up. Fiery Romance. Oh. Oh, yes. I see them. Good job, Ellen. I'm sorry they're at the Goodwill, but good for you. All right. Any cool frames? That one's nice. I got a couple frames last time. They didn't do too well. But again, you look these, or not look them up, but look at them. Because some of them could be like Waterford. Some of them could be, again, Pottery Barn, Pier 1. Different collections of things that um, that sell that people still want. This is cool. Vacation memories photo album. What kind of album is it though? They covered the barcode a bit to be able to look it up. That's how they're gonna be all ripped. Those are neat. All right, we have some bunny things over here. Let's see. Oh, look at that. Made in the USA. Oh, that's cute. It's a couple of them. Oh, it's cracked. But it's a couple of them. That's you neat. A movie with me tonight? Oh my gosh, yes. It's a game. Oh, that's cool. Doesn't that bring back some memories? Yes. You get the free popcorn on the way out. That was West Coast video. Oh, yeah. Blockbuster didn't give you nothing for free. Wow. That's how we did it in the old days, kids. Yep. Movie night. 
That is funny. One movie for me. Oh my gosh. You. you were, nah, you were lucky if you got a movie. At least I was, anyway. Usually it was just the adults picking the movie. Oh, here's, some of these do well too, guys, but you gotta get them, that would have probably done good, but you gotta get them when they're still sealed because now you don't know what's missing. So, like, let's see about this one. And it's orange, see, still sealed. We can scan it and it'll be half off. So I'll grab that. I have one listed already. <clears throat> that we got, um, it, was a, it was thrifted. It was a little while ago, like maybe a week or so. And it's listed. It's a really cute, like uh, Christmas stocking one. We have more Easter stuff up there. Easter crafts, Easter grass. What's that? Happy holidays. What is this one? Um, oh, cute. Someone's wood crafts. That's another cool um, thing to grab while you're here. Oh, look at this, a knitting counter. Peg it, knitting counter. Oh, what is this? Quick Mac, wreath kit. That would be half off too. So I'm gonna scan both of these, but I'm gonna bring them over here because my hands are full, so. Oh, what did know he what find? Think about that. Hold on. There's like a ton of dogs. Look at that. Oh yeah, I'll definitely look at those. I wasn't sure, I know you did the like, one number mm -hmm. bunch of egg deal. Is it the, um, the... The marble type? Oh, cool, yeah. okay. Okay. Are these on sale yet? Darn. They're they blue. No, that never they, works. They've been here forever. I know. Um, but anyways, what I was gonna say is that's another cool thing to look for, the wood stuff. Um, Cause you could redo it, you know. Paint it how you like. Paint it how you like. All these little wood crafts. All right, well, that might be it for this aisle, I think. Oh, what are those? Some of these are old school, made in Taiwan. So they're vintage skeleton, vintage rubber skeleton gloves. That's how I'll look them up. And we'll see, because we sold a scream mask. We did pretty good with the scream mask. So, I'll look these creepy things up. So these are listed for like $14.99, which isn't terrible, like, but there's no solds. So you'll be waiting, you know? And that's not a whole ton of money to have sitting on your shelf, but I'm also trying to make a little bit more than that per item. So we're not gonna grab those. Oh, look at this nice big rug. Oh, I always grab these from here. Oh, I like that one. Looks brand spanking new. And, oh, and I saw these, I wanna show you. I did, there was just a couple little linens here. Nothing crazy like last time, but they're really pretty. And then this is like a lace, circular, I think, tablecloth. So, that's not all I spotted in the linens. And then their uh, comforter section is very sparse, so that's that's about it. Normally, I'll check for like the Ralph Lauren stuff, um, the big chunky florals and things that people love. But that's all she wrote for blankets. <laughs> all right, this is going back on the shelf. This is listed right now for two dollars and ninety nine cents. Can't work with that because I'm not trying to lose money, right? It's, $4.99. There's no solds and there's one listed for $2.99. Now the other thing, the needle point that was for, um, oh look at that, $20 though. That was, those are listings for uh, 20 bucks, $25. Yeah, they got a little uh, pricier with their bags of stuff. That one would be half off. Plastic eggs. Oh, 
Someone's excited. There's another big bag. They probably didn't want to put it in a bunch of little bags, so that's how it got sorted. I don't know what's going on over there. That's what I said. They're excited. They found something good. <laughs> There's a Lego thing. And a beanie baby bat. I don't think Universal. Oh, Universal Studios. See, but see how it's kind of floppy. People look for that in stuffed animals. Uh, but that would have been kind of cool. Jurassic Park. Let me see. Yeah. That looks like a Pokemon or something. Yeah, some dolls. And I think that's kind of it. Unless that guy has another cart. Yeah. But, um, I was hoping that was on sale. It's a travel Scrabble game. But that might be it for us here at this Goodwill. That's cute. Let me see. Kind of from a movie. From Moana? Yeah. These would be cute for crafting, you guys. You can make cute projects with, like, puzzles and stuff. There's another one up here. Let me see. Oh, here's a big, giant square. What is this? Let's see what this is. Oh, it's a puzzle on one side, Fox and the Hound. And a Baby Jesus Bible Story puzzle on the other. But you could craft with those. You can craft with those, too, these pieces. Jenga. Yep, you could use the little wood to... Remember I was telling you in my cloche, I was looking for a little something I could prop my chicken yes. up or my whatever, and I couldn't find anything? That would have been perfect. <laughs> but... All right, I'm going to go check the, um, the grab bags up front, I guess, and look in the case. You want to see if that those two expensive things sold? What was the color it was? I don't remember. Uh, so but it's orange out. right now. So it might have been orange. I don't know. Let's go see. All right, here's some of the stuff up front. What do we have? It's gone. Oh yeah, they probably waited and paid that. Um, this is expensive stuff at Ulta. Mario Badescu. It's good stuff. We have some fabric paint. You know, I gotta check for my Bath and Body Works. Some good deals. Oh, I remember getting stuff like this for Gabriel. These little kid soaps. Got some bath bombs back there. Nail polish. Ooh, Essie nail polish. Those are expensive. That one looks kind of open. That's probably all dry. Some more. China Glaze, that's expensive. I don't know about that brand. Ella and Mila. OPI is expensive. Are they half off of what though? Half off of too much. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, so the tiger's gone, or the panther's gone, I mean. And the, the vase. But those are half off. Okay, so you see that? They want 129 for it. You see this? I got this for $15 at a different Goodwill. Yeah, so, it might not be that shape. No. It's... But, and look, the jewelry bag, let me just get a closer view of that. It's $100 for plastic jewelry. I mean, you might get lucky and find something sterling in there, but just a general look, it's a bunch of cost, junk costume jewelry. Now, not all costume jewelry is junk jewelry, but... I'm sorry, that's just still too much. <laughs> that's, a, yeah. that's still too much for that. So there's no, um, like, I don't know, there's no excusing or no. <laughs> explaining that one away. But I don't think there was nothing in here that I would grab right now. All right, guys, well, let me show you a little snippet. Oh, I totally missed that. How do you miss that? It's got a Christmas tree. I know, I missed it. How much is this bag? And that's Philosophy. Who? Philosophy, the brand. There's no price. There's on. no price. Well, it looks like 
You want to ask the girl? They, then I'll have to call a manager. I think she is a manager. Instead of just She's giving me a price. So yeah. this this is what it looks like we're getting right now. We're going to grab this. Um, we haven't decided on this one yet. But... You like this one, go with your gut. And then this thing, this has all these dogs in there. That's and cool. I just did a quick search of Bath & Body Works candle stands and I'm getting this especially at half off because some of them at the cheapest are like $25. And then I'm hoping that doesn't have any darn chips underneath chips. it because that happens a lot. Yeah, so that's kind of really cool. Not, so. And then Aaron found me the bag of um, like knee pads and stuff. So we're gonna ask about this. And then we have these glass or the stone eggs, but mm -hmm. in like pretty Easter colors. So that's what we're gonna get today. Okay. And then we'll be probably off to another Goodwill. Here's some little bags while I'm waiting in line. Oh, look at Juicy Couture one. <gasps> it's $15 though. Golly, Bianca would like that. All right, Aaron just got called up to the register. And Klein. Gosh, she would like that. Too bad it's not orange. I just saw a Juicy Couture, a red little wallet. But it's 15 bucks, man. Oh, man. Darn it. Okay, well, we're paying now. All right, guys, we are finished. We are. In the Goodwill. First one, anyway. So First one. Two more to we get don't to. have like a filled cart, no. but we did find some stuff. A couple things for our live sales, a couple things for eBay, a couple things for me, like the. You know the knee pads and stuff for my roller skate but anyways thank you guys so so much for watching yes thank you for watching make sure you like comment and subscribe and as aaron said in the beginning go over and follow him on instagram <laughs> it's mr chapter 2 vintage co y'all can give me a follow as well if you'd like yes do that <laughs> and you can see what we find yes so make sure you uh leave some comments leave some thumbs up and we'll talk to you guys in another video Bye from that. Bye. What? No. Here we go. Let's start that again. Ready, Chuck? Bye from Florida. Bye. <laughs>